After the campfire, the first year of high school will not be anything like incoming freshmen may have imagined it would be. Action is now reporter Cecile Juliet has more on today's freshman orientation. It's a fresh new start for the freshmen who are coming here today to Paradise High School for freshman orientation. This year is going to be great. It's exciting. It's been one of the hard years. The first week at Paradise High School is going to be unlike any other year with a shared camaraderie. We are ready to go. We've been working really hard with what few staff members we have left. These people have lived through tragedy and they're ready to triumphantly once again fill these halls. I didn't have that school spirit before. I didn't know how much I appreciated the campus. Yes, I wish it was June 7th and I can go lay by a pool again, but you know, I, I have a job to do and I'm, I'm excited to see the kids. Action News Now had spoken to teacher Stephanie Minderhoud on the day of the campfire after she evacuated students in her own car surrounded by flames. You're what we would call a hero. Huh. Yeah, the whole town of Paradise are heroes. This campus was one of the few Paradise areas that was spared by the campfire. But Director of Food Services Tanya Harder says their off-campus food storage building was destroyed. Finding a way to feed students has been a challenge, but teamwork has made the dream work. And like so many campfire survivors, she and her team have prevailed. We have multiple challenges, but they are conquering each one of them, and it's, it's wonderful. The school provided a link crew made up of older students on hand to guide freshmen through the intimidating process of entering a new school. They enter high school knowing at least 10 people that they can say hello to in the hall. These people have lived through a terrifying experience and are much more appreciative of each other. Everyone's a little closer and they have a tighter bond than they did before or after what happened. Now being a bobcat means you are a survivor with a whole new community of friends. The Paradise Unified School District says there were 3,300 students enrolled in the system last year. This year, they're expecting fewer than half of that to return to school. Cecile Juliet, Action News Now. Well, the first day of school for Paradise High is this Thursday.